everyone to Project Mixologist. I'm Jason Catalano, and on this channel we like to make mixed drinks with spirit flavorings. For this video, we're gonna be going over the Prince Smoothie, and this is part of our Detox Smoothie series. All right, welcome everyone to, uh, to this video. We'll be going over the Prince Smoothie here, the overview of it. So this particular smoothie is a detox smoothie. It's got a lot of good things to cleanse your liver, your kidney, your stomach. And for me, the way I like to think of it in terms of Prince is the Raspberry Beret, really focusing on raspberries. It's gonna be coming in at 420 calories, 40 grams of protein. So it's a very, very good breakfast smoothie, packed with protein, and it's gonna let you clean out a lot of those major organs for you. And so with that, let's go ahead and let's, uh, let's make it. All right, so first ingredient we'll be going over is the almond milk, four ounces of almond milk. This is gonna give us uh, liquid. It's gonna give a little bit of a uh, nice kind of unsweetened vanilla, creamy taste to the smoothie. Next is four ounces of cranberry juice. You can do the light version, you can do the diet, or you can do the original. This one's the original, so it's gonna have a little more sweetness to counteract the beets as well as the raspberry. So that's how it goes. Okay. Next, we're gonna put in the Greek yogurt. So this has a lot of probiotics in it. Uh, this is just really, really good for the morning. Get the, uh, the stomach digestion to go good. A lot of good protein and with the Greek yogurt, it's pretty much taking out a lot of the uh, lactose. So if you're lactose intolerant, something like that, uh, this is a better option than normal yogurt. High protein, good probiotics, good for the digestive health. So next is going to be the beets. So the beets are gonna be really, really good for, uh, for blood flow. It's gonna be really, really good to opening up those. Yeah, it's gonna be good for blood flow and then it's also gonna be good for cleaning out things like the liver. So this is a cup full of beets. So I just get the canned stuff. You can chop up your own if you want to. Next, what we're we'll doing is one cup full of raspberries. And once again, raspberries, really, really good for cleaning out you know, the liver and cleaning out the stomach and just, uh, just gonna help with that. The detox is gonna be the raspberries. Not quite as sweet as a lot of the other fruits you might be used to, but uh, it's definitely going to make for uh, a little bit more on the sour side of a smoothie, but overall so far, pretty good. We're going to be doing a scoop of the protein powder, main source of protein with this smoothie. Okay, goes up top, one full scoop of it. Okay, so you can use any protein powder you want. Um, I usually just either get the cheap stuff, so I get it in bulk. And then last but not least, one of the secret ingredients, of course, is going to be, uh, this is Liquor Quick London Dry Gin Essence. And if you take a smell, yeah, it smells like a Bombay Sapphire, smells like Beef Eater. Uh, it's got that very, very gin smell, very, very dry, kind of poignant, pungent. Uh, we're gonna do a milliliter of that, and we just put that right on top. And that's gonna go very, very well with the raspberries and the beets, drawing out the flavors there. Uh, typically gin goes with a lot of berries. And with that, let's go ahead and let's mix it up. Okay, let's go ahead and pour it and show you what the raspberry beret looks like. So as it's coming out, creamy, kind of this pinkish red. Okay, so it's kind of creamy pinkish red coming through, kind of a little bit reddish, so as you can see it, as you can see, there's no real filaments or anything like that. It's pretty, uh, just a straight cream bis. So, First taste. Okay, so first taste. Very bright in the beginning. Raspberries definitely shine right in the beginning. The beets kind of then come in at the, the middle part. Raspberries actually has a lingering effect with the gin. Really, really nice. Uh, not sweet but not as sour or dry as I thought. It was actually a little more balanced, still on the drier side, 
especially the lingering, but definitely not as dry as I thought. So second taste. Yeah, raspberries up front, a little bit of the beets, and then this kind of sour, drier notes with the gin at the end. It's not as thick. If you want to add another ice cube, if you want to add an ice cube in this, or some xanthan gum, like a teaspoon, a quarter teaspoon of xanthan gum, to thicken it up a little bit, it might help it, but it is a, it runs a little bit on the velvet side, but I think that makes it very Prince-like, just velvet smooth. And with that, yeah, this is the Prince smoothie. This is the Raspberry Beret. Thanks for watching this video on the Raspberry Beret Prince smoothie. If you like this uh, types of smoothies, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And if you can comment down below your favorite part about the smoothie, your favorite ingredient, or what would you change about the smoothie, definitely we're gonna go through that and we can make different variations of the Prince smoothie. With that, giddy up.